All right, I just want to do a little quick video here. I weighed up all of the batteries that I have in the different ranges, 2S, 3S, at the different milliamp hour rating levels from both Tattoo and RDQ, mainly to see how they compare as far as their milliamp hour per gram level and to see, uh, you know, if I'm going to be buying more batteries, you know, is there an advantage one way or the other, assuming the pricing isn't really be that big of a factor. And if you look here, the uh, in the ones in the rectangles, the 3S450, the Tattoo is a little bit better as far as that measurement goes, 14%. The 3S850, the RDQ, comes out ahead by 27%. And then uh, in the uh, 850 level, the RDQ again comes out 20% advantage over the, at least the one I have, which is this XF Power uh, pack. So... It's one way to look at things when you're trying to make a decision on what kind of uh, pack to buy and from which manufacturer. So uh, I'm sure that you might have some other considerations, but this is one way to look at it. And plus it'll give you some information here on the weights that you may or may not have on batteries that perhaps uh, that'll help you when you're doing your own analysis. All right. Thanks for watching.